Welcome to It's Tomorrow News. I am Hena Talati. Temperatures forecast to reach mid 40s as heat wave hits northern Australia. Temperatures are expected to soar across the northern Australia over the coming days as the heat wave spreads across the western Australia and the northern territory and Queensland. Weather zone meteorologists said hot air was building over the northwest of the continent and moving east, driving temperatures in some areas as high as 5 degrees Celsius to 6 degrees Celsius above the average. Temperatures in the western Australia's Marble Bar in the Pilbara exceeded 45 degrees Celsius on Sunday and Monday. That Sunday was the first 45 degrees Celsius observation in Australia this season. Modeling suggested temperatures in the northern western Australia could reach 47 degrees Celsius by coming weekend. The Bureau of Meteorology forecasts that in the parts of central and western Queensland maximum temperatures will rise to the low to mid 40s with overnight maximums potentially in the high 20s. A senior meteorologist at the bureau said he expected temperatures peaking in the mid to high 30s on Thursday for Queensland's southeast before a cooler change on Friday, dropping temperatures by about 10 degrees Celsius. In the northern interior of the state, he said, temperatures would peak in the low to mid 40s on Friday. The heat wave was less normal during the La Nina, but these temperatures can certainly happen. 45 degrees Celsius recorded in Marble Bar over the weekend was the latest in the season that mark has been broken since 1999. Because of the negative Indian Ocean Dipole and the La Nina, we actually haven't seen the first 45 degrees Celsius until the little bit later than usual. With that negative Indian Ocean Dipole, there's been more cloud cover, which has helped to suppress the temperatures over the northern Australia. The Bureau of Meteorology confirmed on Tuesday afternoon that the IOD had swung into the neutral phase with the index showing neutral values for five consecutive weeks. It also said a La Nina was ongoing in the Pacific Ocean, but modeling suggested a return to neutral in January or February. The Bureau's long-range forecast continue to indicate above median rainfall is likely for much of the Eastern Australia, at least during the early summer. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.